the oceans store 90% of the excess heat that have gone into the atmosphere as a result of global warming. So that's a whole lot of energy. In some ways, it's an even more compelling metric than global surface temperature. And it's the highest level since records began about six, dec six decades ago. It's been a steady upward trend since about 1970. Each decade has been warmer than the decade that preceded it. That means you're probably going to have more frequent and intense ocean uh, heat waves, marine heat waves, which have their own impacts. The oceans provide, again, energy for things like tropical storms, or um, they have an impact on melting things like, you know, ice sheets. Or warm water expands, which increases sea level, which then causes tidal flooding.